Okay, this is, uh, I don't know what this is, but uh, if you haven't seen this series before, I'm uh, breaking up Christian Prince videos into uh, downloadable bits. Oh, I'm getting a phone call here. Uh, I'll continue here. Divide 1 minus 1 on 50 x 12 x 27232166161 and then they get the number 299979299994 and then the etc is equal to 0999999981 this is time deletion time difference anyone understand anything anyone understand anything me myself i understand nothing they are using numbers to confuse you because the Quran is so clear. One day is equal to 50,000 years of your time. And that means there's two timing. There's day, one day, and there is 50,000 years. Is that correct, guys? Is that clear? The verse is so clear. One day is equal to 50,000. As long as the Muslims are taking it in a literal way, that means Allah is inside the time. Is that correct? As long as the Muslims are calculating the day of Allah, this is the day of the Allah of Allah. This is not the day of anyone. This is where Allah is located. His day is one thousand year for us, one day for him, and later is going to be. One day is equal to 50,000 years. That means Allah is inside the time. And if Allah is inside the time, that means He age. And if Allah He age, that means He is under the physic. He grow. And that means He is not out of time and He is just a creature like everybody. How Muslims can make such a mistake about their God? If we go to the verse which they mentioned before that one day is equal to 1,000 year, look what it says here. In chapter 50, ch chapter 22, verse number 47, compare between the time of earth and the time of paradise. Okay, who is in paradise? Allah. So, according to Islam, Allah have a day in paradise and his day is equal to 1,000 years. That's mean Allah, he have a day like us. And he age and he is inside the time. That means he is inside the physic rules. Because this is nothing but the physical physic rules. Time in reality, by the way, does not exist. Guys, is time is exist actually? Is time is exist? Any Muslim can tell me if time is exist. Let us see who is a smart Abdul. Is time is exist? Yeah, does time exist? This is the question. Who want to answer me? Does time exist? If there is something really is called time. Did God created days or he he gave us a measurement of days? It was a measurement. It's an agreement to manage to me, you know to to uh, to measure. The same way when you say uh, <clears throat> uh, you, you know like uh, you are one year old. But the fact there is no one year and there is no two years and there is no three years and there is no five years. Time does not exist. For time to be exist, it has to be something physically exist. Time have no physical existence. Time is our own creation. Let us say it's a it's a it's a measurement. We decide to count per day, like the sun said, the sun, etc. But it's not really about a physical thing is exist. So how something 
is called time is exist for God if God is out of time. We are inside the time because we have a physical body and we age. In other way, our 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 cells are not able to refresh each you know, itself. So by time, our body will be routing like we are our uh, is is exceeding its ability to renew the cells, and then we get older and older, and our skin st start looking different, and you know our walk, our health, etc. But this is not because of the time itself, but because our physical or our physique design is made such a way. It have let's say, uh, it have a, a max of use. You know what I mean? I, I'm trying to explain to you what I'm trying to say. Like the time, it, it, guys, do the Muslims believe that in the heaven of Allah, the Muslims will not age? Don't they? Is that correct? If we go to the description of the Quran for the heaven of Islam, you will see that Muslims will never age, they will never get old, they will never have wrinkles in their faces. Okay. Do we have time there? According to our verse, they are showing us this, they have time. According to the verse, they are showing us, they have time. The only difference is that your physique will change. Your physical body will change the nature of it. You will be able, supposedly, to refresh. Your cells will be always renewed as a young person. So either the Muslim trying to say to us that Allah have a time and his time is include him, or the Muslims are saying to us that Allah is not outside of the time, is outside of the time. But based on this, they are proving to us that Allah is a creature like us and he's inside the time. And we can prove that from the hadith of Muhammad. Do you guys remember when Muhammad, he says, and just to get the Muslims busted in everything they say, that those billions of years are false and the distance they are talking about is false. Any of you remember when Muhammad, he says that Allah, he come day every day in the third part of the night? Do you remember the hadith? Do you remember? Look with me in the screen. This is Muhammad talking, not me. If one day for Allah is equal to 1,000 year, how Muslims can explain to us this stupid hadith, which is a sahih hadith coming from the Muslims? Read with me, please. <clears throat> Allah Messenger said, who is the one who is talking? If you guys can post the link in for people on YouTube, that will be good. Uh, let us see, I will post it. Here we go. Is the link showing, guys, in YouTube? <clears throat> Our Lord, which means Allah supposedly, the blessed, the exalted, descends every night to the lowest heaven. Guys, read with me, and let me show you how the, the art, the art of destroying Islam. After all this article and all, all the numbers and 9999.9.1.57.78, we divide them in five, we x them with twelve, and we divide them with twenty and the top them, some of them then we add nine one with minus one plus one. We find the stupid Muhammad saying the following that Allah he come every night he come where guys he come where read with me on the screen Allah he come every night where somebody tell me <coughs> where to the lowest heaven thank you to the lowest heaven as long they are saying that it is a warm hole, where is the lowest heaven? 
Is that our galaxy? At least our galaxy, because there's many galaxies. The universe is so big. And the wormhole they are talking about is in our galaxy, not in different galaxy. So Allah, He come every night. How Allah can come every night if He is, if His timing is different? Aren't they talking to us, saying to us that one day of Allah is equal to 1,000 years now, and later one day for Allah is equal to 50,000 years? Guys, you know what I mean? <clears throat> if there is, if the timing in the in the space is different from the time in the earth, how Allah come every night? He is not coming to the earth yet, and he is not going to the, come to the earth at all. He is still in the space. But Muhammad, he used the term night. Do you see it? And he will do that every night. Every, every. You see the word every? Now this is night in our time or Allah time? Any Abdul can answer? How time is relative and Allah will come every night and he is still in the space and Muhammad he called it night not only he called it night no he gave more details he say read with me carefully please when one third of the night is left which mean Allah will come not only in the night at the end of the night so he have like a window of two hours so we are not talking about thousands of years and millions of years. We are talking about hours now. But yet Allah still is in the space. People on YouTube, do you understand what I'm saying or is is not clear? <coughs> Anyone don't understand? <coughs> Anyone don't understand? If the Muslim trying to convince us that there's a wormhole and 50,000 years is equal to uh, billions of years and etc., blah, 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 then how Allah He come in the third part of the night, which is a window of two hours maximum, three hours maximum? If the, if the, if the night is eight hours, third of the eight hours, what the number will be? Guys, the third of eight hours, what will be? If the night is eight hours, maximum two to point five or three hours maximum. But the Muslims trying to fool us about one thousand year and then it's fifty thousand years and that is equal to billions of years. But look with me, how the Muslims get themselves busted more. Didn't we just read the article before this one was measuring the day of Allah of billions of years? Correct? Guys, focus, focus with me. In the article before this, one day for Allah was equal to what according to Muslims? Here. 